warm, humid, breezy, but fog free here this morning. Thanks to that breezy southerly wind up around 20 miles per hour. It's 72 degrees outside the dew point at 70 signaling some awfully humid air in place, but the visibility again yesterday we had dense fog this morning with that wind out of the south. No problems with respect to how thick the fog is. It's breezy near the coast near 20 miles per hour. Some places a little bit calmer, but overall a whole lot more wind than what we had yesterday morning, and that wind is keeping temperatures hovering in the low 70s for the most part. We've also got some cloud coverage overhead, but the clouds will disperse this afternoon. There's a weak front working into the central and north parts of Texas. This front is not going to make it here, but it will approach before it stalls out, and that will serve to lower the winds in general today, 10 to 15 miles per hour rather than that 20 to 30 that we had yesterday. A little bit of a difference in temperature, 50s and upper 40s in the panhandle north of that front, 60s and low 70s to the south of it. We're going to continue with this trend of very warm weather through the remainder of the work week through Friday as heat builds into the southern and southeastern part of the country. See that big ridge in the jet stream trough out to the west. That's going to be where our next system comes in from. It's very broad right now out in the Pacific Ocean off the Pacific Northwestern coastline. This is going to slide down the West Coast through tomorrow and Thursday, and then it's going to make its turn through the desert Southwest on Friday into the plains on Saturday, and it'll be Saturday morning that we get the cold front that'll be stemming off of this system. It'll bring a little band of rain as it works through. The rain is not going to be impressive with this feature. This one, though, will cool us off low 80s Saturday afternoon and drier mid 70s on Sunday and then another system coming in from the west. This one looks to prompt a better chance for rain as it takes a more direct path toward central and south Texas on Monday. So I think Monday at this point uh, looks like the best shot for rain over the next seven between now and Friday highs near 90. It's very possible that we get into the low 90s any of the next four days here. Our front puts an end to that run of warm weather, low 80s Saturday, mid 70s on Sunday, and we'll keep the 70s around with a better shot for rain early next week. Near 70 this morning, some cloud coverage that gives way though to mainly sunny skies. Highs near 90 this afternoon. Heat index value is going to be in the mid 90s here today. Fog spreads in tonight. There will be some areas of thick fog, I think, tomorrow morning mid 60s with calmer winds and then back with the mainly sunny skies and highs near 90 here on Wednesday. Today 89 again that heat index in the mid 90s with afternoon sunshine. Southeast wind not as strong as yesterday 5 to 15 miles per hour tonight. Winds are going to be calm with all the humidity in place. Temperatures cooling into the mid 60s. We're going to see some areas of fog. Winds out of the southwest no more than about 10 miles per hour. Near 90 through Friday with a blend of sun and clouds each day. Cold front comes in Saturday morning with a little chance for rain. 82 Saturday, 60 by Sunday morning with a high of 76 to wrap up the weekend. And then the rain chances again look to be best on Monday if the forecast holds as it looks right now. Barbie.